Okay, so we're gonna make this uh, simple pasta salad. And honestly, you can add anything you want or omit anything you want. Of course, you're gonna boil your pasta. I'm putting in chopped onions, a chopped tomato, some uh, Colby Jack cheese, any kind of cheese you wanna use though. I'm using dill relish and some sliced up olives with pimentos. You can use black olives, pickled, um, like the sweet relish if you want. Um, and I'm also using zesty Italian dressing. Some people like ranch, some people like mayo, anything you want, seriously. And then you just have to make sure your pasta is cool and shake up that Italian dressing and add it. I had the whole bottle, um, most of the bottle, because uh, it's a lot of pasta. Um, this is just for lunches and everything throughout the week. And then I just toss in all the veggies. Um, sometimes I'll put sliced mushrooms if I have them. Um, I also put chickpeas in this. I didn't show that at the beginning, but I do put some chickpeas or garbanzo beans, whatever you want to call them. And um, so I just, it's so simple. You just incorporate all that stuff. And I like to cook the pasta till just tender I don't I don't want it too al dente but I don't want it too mushy either um, and all of it is really personal preference and mix it all up um, some people like to add broccoli carrots celery I don't add celery to anything and then I just chopped up some lunch meat this is a chicken rotisserie chicken um, I, I normally would get something from the deli but the, the grocery store I went to did not have a very good deli so um, this is just pre-packaged and you don't have to add it at all if you don't want to and so you just mix it all up um, some people like to also add like chopped egg uh, what are those things bean sprouts went ahead and put a little more dressing in there and mix it up and you want to um, there, there goes the garbanzo beans or chickpeas. They are really tiny chickpeas for some reason. I don't know what was up with that. But I just mix it up really good and get that dressing all tossed in there. Um, put a, a, a lid on it and then I let it chill. You want to chill it for at least a half hour, but I chilled it overnight. And um, Eric took it for his lunches. And there it is. It's nice and pretty and bright and fairly healthy.